guys me and joe just got home the usual full length mirror i use has been put away because the spot it's usually in is right here and this is where we have our christmas tree right now so i have to use the old one that i was using when we first moved in it's on the door of my walk-in closet this was actually left by the previous owner and i'm in the process of switching out my winter clothes so this hallway is a mess it's not something i would usually show you guys but you know can't say i'm not authentic but we just got back from david busters so you're probably gonna see this out of order because i'm probably gonna share this clip first but we went as a double date with um a couple friends that joe knows the husband and it's a small world because i went to high school with the wife so it's nice we get along really well and today was her birthday um and she wants to go to david busters we went to the one in braintree uh, cause like I tell you guys, I am, I say the Boston area, it's not exactly Boston, but I'm somewhat in that area. Um, so Braintree is in that area. Uh, it was really nice. We had dinner and then we did the arcade games. So you guys are going to see some clips of the games after this, but it is freezing cold in mass. So all I want to do is wear long sleeve cozy shirts. So this is like an oversized Henley, uh, from Target. Let me see the name brand because mm, there's a few brands that fit me universal thread um and i love it. it has like a double cuff i love this so much i have it i bought it in green first and then i loved it so much i bought it again in the blue and then i'm wearing my anna and viv plus size jeans from there i love these they're like super duper stretchy and comfortable they do have some slits at the knee which I'm not going to lie, was really cold this time of year. Um, and I had my little Ugg boots on. I'll probably wear it with leggings next time. <laughs> Still trying to wear out a little bit of my fall. Yeah, but hold on, I'm filming a clip. A little bit of my fall clothes. Because I definitely won't wear these jeans soon. Because it is getting ice cold. And I will be in full-on winter gear soon. But anyway, yeah. So we had a good time at David Buster's. I hope you guys enjoyed the clips. I would have got more. But <laughs> my phone battery was low. And also, it was hard to film the arcade games that me and Joe played together. Like, we played Hungry Hungry Hippo together. We played Connect Four together. So I he wasn't available to film it because he was playing the game with me. Uh, the only reason you guys were able to see the axe-throwing game was because the friends we were with filmed it. Um, but for majority of David Buster's, other than when we ate, we kind of split up. Uh, that was like right before we left. Me and Joe still had tokens left. And we were like, oh, we're going to play one more game. And I said, can you film us while we're doing it? Uh, but it was a really, really fun time. Uh, I don't know how. I think it's a chain, right, Joe? David Buster's is a chain. Yeah. So if you have one in your area, definitely look it up. It's more of like an adult arcade. Like you even after a certain hour, you have to be like 21 and over. Uh, because they have like a really big bar and it's just really fun and you cash in tickets it's uh, like a nostalgic of like Chuck E. Cheese but for adults basically um but yeah so this is the outfit I wore me and Joe had a good time right you had a good time no. did you have a good time yeah. again you guys are seeing my mess this is Christmas explosion these are Christmas boxes all those white boxes Christmas gifts I already wrapped some of them. Some of the here, some of them are here wrapped under the tree. This is all gonna be cleaned out. Thank God I had the long weekend for Thanksgiving. But what were you saying? Uh, I, I said, did you have a good time? Yeah, I did. All right, and now we're both ready for bed, right? Mm, maybe, maybe not. <laughs> Joe's never ready bed. No, I'm definitely ready for bed. Good night, guys. Ignore me. I didn't mean to say good night because now you guys are gonna see the clips of the arcade. So hold on tight <laughs> if you want to see the really cool games that we played. But yeah, if you guys like this, I have been trying to do more vlogs. I post them on Fridays. Mondays are always Mass Mondays. Thursdays are always book club videos. And Tuesday, Wednesday are always hauls and unboxings. So that is the schedule for my channel. If you are liking it, definitely consider subscribing. Hit the notification bell. Give the video a thumbs up so I know that you guys are liking the vlogs. But yeah, let's get on to the footage. <laughs>
see your technique, just throw all the balls. <laughs> oh, almost there, babe. Any balls left? No. Hey! Four, three, two, one. Oh, yeah. You failed. What do you mean fail? What? What do you mean fail? You get all the colors. I'm not a god, but look at the points. Oh, you beat me. Hey. I gotcha. That's yeah. all you care about. Oh, uh, uh, not always my competition. This is fun. There's no following that. <laughs> yeah, no way. Pick a number. Which one you pick? 16 for a start. Is that the one you think that has the tickets? I'm picking the one that I think has the tickets. Yeah. You chose case number 16. Um,
All right, guys, that was it for the Dave and Buster's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. I did plan on filming more, but one, my battery was kind of low. And two, a lot of the games were not working, which was kind of a bummer. Um, we went for Joe's friend's birthday. It's um, He's friend with the husband, and I'm friends with the wife, so it's kind of nice. We go out on double dates all the time, and she had another couple that she's friends with. Go. So it was a group of six of us. Um, we went to the one in Brain Tree, which borders like Boston. I tell you guys, that's generally the area I live in. We do actually have one closer to us in Providence, because I tell you guys where I live in Mass almost borders Rhode Island. But they specifically wanted to go to the one in Brain Tree, so it was a longer drive for us, which again would have been fine. Except I found that the one in Providence was better. Um, it ate a lot of our tokens. The games weren't working. Um, Hungry Hungry Hippo was one of my favorite games as a kid. And now David Busters has like the adult version of it. You actually sit on the hippo and ride it. And that was one of the ones that kept eating our tokens. <coughs> Which is definitely a bummer. But that is it for the video if you guys are liking the vlogs definitely give a thumbs up it helps me know what you guys are enjoying because like you guys know i, I do want to branch out and not just do hauls um this was about two weeks ago at this point this is going to be included in like my vlogmas i've been posting every day for the month of december i'm trying to get ahead of the game and schedule my videos so i finally edited this video and it is ready to go so if this interests you and you guys want to see more from me, definitely consider subscribing because, like I said, I am posting every day in December. It's going to be hauls. It's going to be unboxings. It's going to be vlogs. It's going to be cooking. It's going to be reviews. It's going to be a little bit of everything. I know I'm really enjoying it. I hope you guys are as well. Comment down below. Let me know if you've ever been to David Buster's or if you have something similar in your area. It really is a fun night. Me and Joy really enjoyed ourselves. Did I say me and Joy? Me and Joe. Uh, we had dinner there and everything. And they have a bar. It is a really good time. But I was just bummed out that kept eating our tokens. But that's it for this video, guys. Be safe.